All right, do you wanna hear something crazy? I have never met a single person who was pro-porn or pro-masturbation that had ever quit either porn or masturbation for an extended period of time. Now think about that, okay? Think about it, really. Like, in any other circumstance, if someone said, oh yeah, that movie sucks, and I said, oh, did you watch it? And they're like, no. Would you take them seriously? No. And they're like, oh, that, that restaurant sucks. It's like, whoa, what happened? Did you eat there? And they served you bad food? You didn't like it? He's like, well, I never actually been there. It's like, you would never take someone seriously like that, right? It's like, my, my daughter does this to me. She's three and a half. And I'm like, here, eat this food. You'll love it. She'll be like, no. I'm like, you never even tried it. And she's like, no, I know I don't like it. It's like, no, you don't. <laughs> you don't actually know because you've never actually tried it. And so this is why it's crazy because everybody feels like they have this uh, authority to say, oh, yeah, you got to you gotta masturbate. It's totally normal. Oh, you got to use porn. Everybody uses porn. Come on. We're all going to use it, right? It's like, they don't actually know what it's like on the other side. So let me be really clear here. Like I was a porn addict, all right? I was addicted to masturbation. You know, I spent, you know, over a decade living that way. Well over almost like a, you know, 15 years living like that. And then I quit. And now I've been off porn and masturbation for almost 9 years. And let me tell you, the difference is clear. It's night and day. Your life is 10 million times better without either of those activities. And everybody who says, oh no, it's that can't be true, they've never actually done it, all right? They've never actually gone through the full like withdrawal periods, gotten through it, and to the other side. Because that's the thing is, the reason why everyone thinks it sucks is because they try and stop for a few days, they get hit with horrible withdrawal symptoms, they don't understand it's withdrawal symptoms because they don't understand they could be addicted to it in the first place, and then they just assume, oh, this is the way you feel always? Well, clearly this is worse. It's like, no, it's like someone who's a heroin addict trying to quit heroin for a few days. They're going to feel absolutely horrible, okay? And then they conclude, well, clearly my life would get worse if I quit heroin, which is obviously not true. They just have to get through the adaptation period, right? What's more is that I've now like worked with thousands of guys, like thousands of guys have gone through my programs, you know, I've meant I've run basically a weekly almost mentoring call or worked with, you know, men's groups to some extent for the past like eight years, every single week, some often multiple times a week. I've had, you know, over 100 individual coaching clients like I've seen it all. And guess what? Everybody's life gets better when they quit this stuff every single time. I've never seen an exception where someone fully quit this and their life got worse. I've never seen it one time. Now, don't get me wrong. Quitting porn is not some kind of magic bullet that automatically makes your life awesome. You know, in some ways it will instantly fix certain problems in your life. Uh, things like sexual dysfunction, um, you know, sometimes confidence issues, focus issues, you know, dopamine detox kind of stuff that can all be very intense and direct. But really what it does is it lets you live confidently. It lets you live free from having to feel like you have this part that's hidden, you know, about you. Uh, it also clears up your brain, your neurobiology, so that you're not blowing all this dopamine on stupid stuff that makes your life worse. It helps you start actually showing up to life because it doesn't give you the option, an instant feel-good button to hide from everything. So you have to actually start addressing things. But it puts you in this position to where you can really start living a life that you don't want to escape from. And that's Insane, all right? That's an insanely valuable thing that most guys, they just don't really know. They don't, most guys don't know even how to hold their own sexual charge. They just need to shoot it out into some tissues. Otherwise, they're like, oh, I, I can't handle it. My sexual charge is too much for me. It's like, sack up. Learn how to hold that energy. Learn how to wield that energy. Learn how to make love to life instead of just your hand. Now, obviously, quitting porn is a lot easier said than done. This is why I created my Reforge Man course, which is like the, the third iter fourth iteration? I don't know. It's several iterations into my porn recovery content, and it's the best one yet. It gets guys clean like nothing else out there. So if you want to get that, all you got to do is sign up for the Self Mastery Club. If you want to find out more about the Self Mastery Club, then just click the link. All right. I'll see you in the next one. Ooh, yeah.